Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to Who's Just Signed For Your Club. As you can tell by the thumbnail, I'm on about my own club, the club I support which is Brighton. We have got our third signing across in this window. I'm over chuffed with the signings of Adam Lallana and for Tomlin. Sorry if I mispronounced his name, anyway I do apologise. But our third signing of Ollie Watkins from Brentford. Now, this deal is still a bit in the early stages. Talks have just literally opened between the two clubs. But I think this one will definitely go over the line, which is why this video is here, of course. What do we know about Ollie? Well, he's 24 years old, so, you know, he's, what, got about maybe seven years left in his contract? So he's got, yeah, about seven years left in football, I should have said. Um, He's in the contract of Brentford, as I said, it's still very early days, but end the contract the 30th of June 2023. Why would Ollie leave? Well, we just hit, you know, let's say 24 hours since I'm recording this, that Brentford are playing championship football again next season. I looked at that Brentford squad, I'm speaking about probably half the players will not be playing in Brentford shirt next season. No disrespect to Brentford whatsoever. I just think they've got some really good players in that Brentford squad. And I do feel a bit sorry for Brentford that they did get promoted. I think it was about nine times they failed through the playoffs. How much more can a heartbreaker team have? It really does, you know, get to me when you're reading comments like they failed in the playoffs nine times. Brentford served to be in the Premier League. I think they will do it next season. I'm hoping they'll do it next season. But anyway, back to this player. His main position is the centre forward, so look at our centre forwards, especially if you're a Bright fan. Glenn Murray, I'm not sure, maybe another year, but a year on the bench. That's who I think he will replace. So, Glenn Murray replaced him. Alan Connolly, great up and coming talent. Ben Pepe, don't forget, Ben Pepe came from Brentford to Brighton last season as well. So, yet again, Ollie will be talking to probably Neil and Sam what's good about Brighton and and uh, Neil my pay for sorry I'm not on Miss Blanche last name just a minute ago. But Neil my pay did probably Sam what's good all about Brighton, what they're doing here and so you know he's got that connection with Brighton as well in that uh, Neil my pay. But then like so we go we've got four strikers if you count Glenn. I think Glenn will be a bench player next season. But I think Ollie could be the slight replacement for uh, Glenn Murray. No disrespect to Glenn Murray whatsoever either. But so, right, anyway, so as I say, centre forward. His other positions now, this does question me a bit as well because of the likes of Soddy March questioning being on the move. I don't think Soddy March will move, but it can be on the left or right side. Yet again, does that mean Jack Bash will be on the way out? Please feel free to put it down in the comments below. He's got 50 appearances with 26 goals to his name, so just over half. No, well, he's got 50 appearances. So he's got more goals in half than what his appearances are, which is a good stat to have. I think uh, Neil Mopay has got 10 goals in. I can't remember how many games he's played for Brighton this season, but. He's played a minimum of 4,456 minutes. So literally, you know, a lot of playing time for a 24-year-old. He's a professional white foot, I think it's the same as Neil Mopay as well. But yeah, Ollie Watkins, Brighton player. Definitely will be looking forward to seeing him. I can't say blue and white really, because I'm new shouting blue and white. Well, it is white, but only very thin stripe. Looking, for, looking forward to seeing him in the blue shirt next season. This is of course if it another uh, I don't know Stephen Ward or you know um, Pritchard deal don't happen, but Ollie Watkins probably will be a Brighton player. Probably I'll say in about three weeks' time he'll probably be announced by the club. But anyway, guys, you know what to do. So a big fun, I hope you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao. For now.